Welcome to an introduction to programming using Visual Basic Exercises for Beginners. In this exercise we are going to create a unit price calculator. We are to write a program that requests the price and weight of an item in pounds and ounces and then determines the price per ounce. So a very simple assignment. Here is our form. It's going to be just price of item text box and then text boxes for pounds and ounces. We'll click the button and we will display the price per ounce in another text box. So I'm in Visual Studio 2015. I have my form already ready. So I'll double click the button and go to the button click event and declare a few variables. The first one can be the price. The next one, the price per ounce. So the first one is the price of the item that the user enters and price per ounce is the result of the calculation. So this is going to be double. And then we'll need the pounds and ounces, and those can be integer because we are splitting the weight between pounds and ounces. It's going to be them, pounds and ounces as integer. Now we can get the input, so we'll get the price from the user, and since it's a double and text box is a text, we'll need to convert it to double. So see DBL, and we will convert the text from the text price of item dot text. The next one is the pounds, and that one is an integer, so it's going to be C integer, and it's the txt pounds dot text, and we'll get the ounces, and it will equal C int from the txt ounces dot text. Now to calculate the price per ounce, we need to convert the weight, both pounds and the ounces, into just ounces, and there's 16 ounces in a pound, so to create a variable of total ounces, we'll simply get the ounces from the user plus how many ounces there are in the pounds that the user enters. So pounds multiplied by 16. Like I said, there's 16 ounces in a pound. So now when we have total ounces, we can calculate the price per ounce. So our price per ounce will equal the price that the user enters of the item divided by total ounces. Very simple. And now we can display the result in our text box, so txt price per ounce dot text. And since it's a price, in other words dollars, we'll convert it to currency. So it's going to be price per pounds dot to string, convert it to currency with two decimal places. So let's run it. All right, so the assignment will give us an example of 25.5 as the price of item, 25.50. And the weight is one pound and nine ounces and we should get 1.02 price per ounce. So let's see, and here it is 1.02, and it's formatted as dollars, so it's working correctly. So I hope you liked it, and I'll see you next time.